listen, I won't tolerate you talking to me that way, okay? This is my father's house. <sighs> Are you not too old for this? Eh? You don't like being disrespected, yet she told me I'm the most disrespectful person that I know in my entire life. Daddy, did you hear that? Enough! Both of you, enough! Daddy, please, my niece and nephew need my attention. I better go know what's wrong. Excuse me, please. I'm coming, my darling. Okay. <sighs> you know, <clears throat> you didn't have to wash those plates. Dad, so that Chisom will continue to back out like a dog? Dad, don't worry, I have a car. We'll go home whenever I'm ready, even if we're running late. But you, okay. can't, you can't visit me and, and, and wash the plates. So, so if, 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 if I went to visit you, I'll be washing your plates? <laughs> but Chisom thinks I should. She does. Mm -hmm. Daddy, I don't even know what's wrong with that girl. I mean, I'm older than her and I've seen way more life than she has. But I'm not as frustrated as she is. You, the two of you have been at loggerhead since you, you were knee high to an aunt fighting over trivial things. You should know her better hey, by now. Dad, that's why I said she should go and get her own place. So that when I'm coming to see my father, I can come comfortably and not be angry every time I call, I come here. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now listen to me. Did you hear that? <laughs> at least... She loves <laughs> your children and they're good with her. So I think that's it should come for something. Oh, eh? <laughs> See as it begins, it begin it just they laugh anyhow. <laughs> mm. You and your sister had another fight again, didn't you? Babe, I can't stand that girl. That girl has become so toxic, I don't even understand. <sighs> Babe, what happened again this time? Can you imagine? She was yelling at me and the kids for not washing plates in dad's place. What? Isn't that like your house? Beats me. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's like saying when she comes over, she tells her to wash plates. I don't understand. But she has never eaten here. Well, maybe when she starts behaving better, she will. <laughs> babe, come here, babe. Calm <laughs> here. Stop. I need you to calm down <laughs> and just calm to bed. Babe, you need to stop. The kids are going to hear us now. Let them hear. They were not here when I was paying you bright price. Come she did. Yeah. <laughs> Daddy, just go away, please. You can't keep avoiding me. I'm not avoiding you, Daddy. I'm, I'm, I'm just tired and I need to sleep. Oh, so you're tired from your endless fights with your sister? Chisholm, she is your elder sister and the continued disrespect to show her doesn't speak well of you. Does anything ever speak well of me in this house? Well, maybe if you behave better, you know, and be more considerate, we would accord you the same respect that we show her. After all, you're my daughter. Yeah, of course. Mm. She's the one with a stable life, a beautiful family. The one with the money. Mm -hmm. Whilst I'm the one in this house being a burden to you. I never said that. You don't have to say it. You always show me by your actions every day. <sighs> Daddy, listen. She may have done well in school. But if she had picked up a simple habit of cleaning up after her, then we wouldn't have fought today. 
No. If you had picked up some manners and respect, which you think you have, but you don't, you would have been in your husband's house with your own children by now, instead of picking up needless fights at this age. Thank oh, please. please. Come, kids. Babe, are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, guys. Your school bus is here. Okay, guys. Let's go. Let me take you guys. Have a good day at school. My baby. Mm. Okay. Your school bag. Uh, let's go. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Bye bye, babies. Yeah. Come on, bye bye. bye. Kids are not here, so tell me what really do matter. I checked my email and there's nothing there. <laughs> really? I thought we agreed that we're not going to do that. I thought we we're just going to wait and calm down. Oh, babe, we're talking about the UK embassy. What if they deny my application? <sighs> Look, I cannot pretend that there's nothing wrong with me or when there's something wrong. <laughs> Look. What has worrying solved? Absolutely nothing, okay? I just want you to calm down and trust everything will going to work out well for you. Just have faith, okay? Huh? Let's just calm down and wait a few more days. Hmm? Okay. Oh, it's my dad. Hi, Dad. Oh. Yes. Sorry for keeping you waiting. Uh, it's okay, Dad. So, um, this is the folder. Yes, please. See if you can help me through it and, you know, give me feedback on the quality control aspects, please. Before the end of the day. Yes, what? Of yes. course. Oh, come on, Dad. You know I have my own work. What time will I have to finish this by the end of today? No, 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 no. You can do this. Help me. You know, I have five of those to work on. And, and, and the lady that's in charge, the staff member that's in charge of this, she just put to bed. And I have to do this on her behalf. You know, you know, I have a heart of gold, believe. I can't <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> The invisible child, she should ignore me. Must you to discuss this whole thing? Can't you say I'm watching a TV show? Or are you two trying to rub my joblessness on my face? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, can you imagine? Anna, please. Just let it go. No, maybe we should just go to the library. No, <laughs> no, 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 Dad. We are staying right here. She is not going to bully you into going to anywhere. Not in your own house. Look, you don't have anything to offer. Yet you're always the first person to make commands. 
Are you not ashamed of yourself? Anna, you do not get to talk to me like that. Okay? Enough! I will talk to you the way I want to talk to you. I am your older sister and I pay the bills in this house. If you do not like it, you can pack your things and get out. Madam Bilbeya! Yes, so I have heard you. Elder sister, this elder sister, that. Every minute, elder sister. Rub it on my face. I will rub it on your face if you don't shut up. Come on. Now, please. Calm down. Let this thing go. Dad, if she's not comfortable staying in this house, like I said, you can pack your things and get out. And if you want to be taken seriously in life, Chiso, please do and get a job. Do you understand me? Daddy, can you hear her? Can you hear her insult me over and over again? Every minute of the day she's insulting me and you won't do anything about it. Daddy, she needs to leave the house. Please. She needs to leave. Cap, will you stop this for crying out loud? Rubbish. Chiso. I was just going to say, she's your younger sister. Dad, she needs to leave this house. But where will she go? She you doesn't have a job. You are the one spoiling her. And I do not have time for this. So I'm going to leave right now. When I have time, I'll try and do this. If I don't have time, well, that's that. Every time, every time, she doesn't have a job. <laughs> time is over. I'm looking forward to receiving it. Okay, thank you. Jesus. <laughs> Daddy, please. Must you always be this belligerent? You cannot be this belligerent to your older sister. She pays the bills here. No, if she no. throws you out, where will you go? I just knew you were going to say that. She no, no, no. But you are not dating. You are not It's always the same thing. Every day. That is always the same thing. You okay. always side up. You always take her sides. Okay. Dad? Yeah. It's here. What, what, it's here. What is here? My master's my admission letter finally came in today. It did? Yeah. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Finally! Oh. Oh my god. It's, it's London is calling. I know! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my god. I'm so happy for you. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Okay, babies, you have to go to bed now, okay? Okay, baby. I remember to stay under the duvet because the room is usually very cold. Okay. And no talking because tomorrow is a school day. Alright? Okay. Good night, my dolls. I'm a guy with this one for me. Shh. Mom said no talking. Hi, baby. Congratulations, my darling! <laughs> Finally! You did it. I know, babe. <laughs> Dreams actually do come true. Oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> here am I having mixed feelings because I'm so going to miss my baby. <laughs> I'm going to miss you too. Oh. But besides, I still have one more week to wrap things up before I leave. One week is like a few hours away. Oh, come on, baby. Don't be such a big baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me know when the moment for you. Huh? I'm super happy for you, my darling. Oh, thank you so okay. much, my love. Thank you. You <laughs> have no idea how happy I am. I know. I know. <laughs> yeah. You did it. should at least be happy for her. She's your sister. And who says I'm not happy for her? Like this? No word of congratulations. You've been frowning all day long. Is this you being happy? Daddy, please. Can you just let me be? Let me be before you figure out something else to insult me with. Come on now. Besides, I'm neither a graduate nor even making plans for my master. So please, just let me be. She has always wanted this. This has always been her dream. She's um, 
If it was you that won this, I would have said the same thing to her. You both are sisters, and this fight over absolutely nothing has gone on for far too long. Since when did we become interested in each other's lives? Besides, if I don't congratulate her, won't she still go to the UK? She's um. Daddy, I'm over this conversation, please. I beg you. I'm, I'm tired of this whole thing, please. Just leave me alone. Daddy, I need my peace. So if you continue talking about this, I'll just go upstairs. I'll leave the sitting room for you and go upstairs. So. I'm tired now, Daddy. Just let me be, please. Leave me. She should just carry on with her life. So long as she doesn't keep coming around here and showing her bossy face around here, it's fine by me, okay? Anywhere she wants to go, she should go. It will take exorcism to cast out this bitterness and hatred in you. It's too fast, deep-seated for even your own gold. Nonsense. Baby, we need to talk to the kids. Ah, I know. Do you want me with you when you do it? No, um, no, I'll, I'll talk to them myself. I just need to find the right words to tell them. Come on, babe. If you're just going for two years, it's not as if you'll be gone forever. Babe, two years is a long time. Besides, I've never left the kids for a day before. <laughs> I know, but we can't keep postponing. You'll be gone soon. You just have to let them know. I'll talk to them. Babe, you need to get a nanny and, you know, since you'll be working. That's true. Mom, are you going somewhere? Come here, babies. We need to talk. <laughs> don't go. Mommy, please don't go. Don't worry, my baby. I'll be back soon, okay? I promise I won't take too long. Who's going to take our house? Who's going to stay with us? Not the Oh no, God forbid. Don't worry, I'm going to get someone that's going to take care of you guys very well, okay? No, this is your man that wants to stay with us. You want to stay with Aunt Jiso? And Daddy. Okay, don't worry, I'm going to get someone that will stay with you people, alright? My mom is going to make the best decision for you guys, okay? Get someone that will stay with you people, alright? Okay. Oh, my munchkins, I'm going to miss you guys so much. Mom is going to miss you people very well. Huh? Don't cry, don't be sad. I'll be back, I promise. Alright? I'm going to miss you guys. <laughs> don't worry, I'll be back soon, okay? Miss you guys so much. I'll be. Let me go and say hi to your daddy. See you soon. Just thank you. Um, I need to talk to the agency, you know, to get a nanny that I can trust. Babe, so you're going to trust a uh, total stranger over your kids? If they want you, so why don't we just go ahead and talk to her? God forbid. Babe, you know the way that woman is now. She's your sister. What else is she? Babe, you know that that lady has never liked me in a day. You expect me to entrust my kids in a care. Someone that doesn't like me, how is she going to like my children? Babe, we all know she doesn't like you. But for a fact, we know she adores those kids. I can't leave my children with her. 
So, you've not heard of cases of nannies running away with people's kids? I just can't, Jude. Okay, look, why don't we do it this way? We go over to your dad's place, we have a conversation with her. If she accepts, she comes to babysit the kids. Jude. Look, we have a guest room. She can come stay here. And I'm around. What could possibly go wrong? Hmm? Please? <laughs> and I've told these kids to stop keeping their tab by the edge of the chair. They should always drop it in. Hmm? Come here. Mmm, my baby. Love you. Love you too. Giving it a thought and we can try. For real? Yes. But I'm sure she's going to show us her true colors and turn us down. But I'm just doing it just for the sake of the children. Leo. I'm just thinking about the safety of the children. This should work. I think it should work. Fine. We'll go over there tomorrow and ask her. Like I said, I'm sure she's going to turn us down. <laughs> And then we can start looking for another alternative, okay? <laughs> so, you don't believe this will work, right? I do not. And one more thing. You are doing the asking. You know you're stubborn as her. No. Definitely nothing like her. <laughs> <laughs> I am. No problem. Thank you very much. Do you need anything? Uh, nothing. I'm fine. Coffee, work. Just... Okay. I'm good. <laughs> so, Dad, I called for this meeting to discuss about Ada's travel. Which is so. Me? Yes, um, she'll be leaving in a few days and we needed someone to come watch over the kids for us. This is a joke, right? The kids specifically asked for you, so it's not a joke. Uh, <laughs> it keeps getting worse the more you put your mouth. <laughs> um, Ada, we'll be paying you 300k every month. Please. Yeah. All you have to do is, you know, come and take care of them because they asked for you specifically. Ada. You both us are you two are serious? Ah, oh my god! <laughs> oh my goodness! Hey, Jason, is there anything you would not see in this? <laughs> oh my god! You knew that this was a stupid idea. <laughs> This is unbelievable. Chisomi is now going to be a house help. <laughs> Great! <laughs> Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Keep the insults. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Me in house help. In my sister's house. Wow! <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> you know what? Just forget that I mentioned it, okay? It's fine. Ada, calm down. Let's just think. Let's just think of a way out. Oh my goodness. I'll believe it. Oh. 
Well, she's so. That wasn't necessary, you know. Not everything is an insult. Dad, thank you for having us. Bye. My regards to the kids. I told you this was a bad idea. Did you see the way she mocked us inside? I know. But the most important thing is that we tried. We can't blame ourselves for other people's acts now. Look, we need to go. We need to go and I need to call some people because we definitely need a nanny ASAP. And I need, I need to pack. I don't, I, I don't want to... Babe, just calm down, okay? You're doing well. Just calm down. Alright? Let's just go. This is all your fault. Because so, I told you. Don't worry, we'll figure everything out. I'm buying that girl to mock me. So. wrong with you. Must you ruin every attempt at a reach out, Chisong? Daddy, of all the things in the world to reach out to it, it's the offer to be a nanny. For your nephew and niece. For Christ's sake. This is big. Think about it. You know, come on. A chance to make money while taking care of the two children you've always loved. What is the, what, what is wrong with that? Daddy, what is big about this? Tell me, what is big about this? Isn't this a humiliating and an insulting offer? Humiliating and insulting? How can that be an insult? She came straight to you because you are the only person she trusts with her children. Come <laughs> on. And besides, it will give you a chance for you and your sister to begin to love each other as you should, as friends, as you've always meant to be. Daddy, can you make it make sense? I don't get you. Listen to me. That offer, just making you for two years, you'll be a millionaire in months. Believe me. And when she comes back, you know, and the offer ends, you can start up a lucrative business of your own. And think about it before, you know, she changes her mind and call somebody else. This is your chance. But if you ask me, that is a fabulous offer. That is a fabulous offer. Don't let it go. Think about it. A millionaire. That's what you will be. Huh? Think about it. Nothing yet. They said you were going to call, but now I'm calling them and you're not taking their calls. What does that? I don't have to be at the airport in the morning. Oh, what's with all these calls now? It's Chisom. For real? Yeah. Hello? Really? Yeah, in the morning. <laughs> oh my god, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Yes, yes, yes. I would have the room ready for you tomorrow. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Bye. She agreed, didn't she? I can't believe it, but yes. Oh, oh. <laughs> thank goodness. Now, let's be done with the packing so you can go talk with the kids. Oh, baby. And I'm going to miss you. Oh, I, I will miss you too, my darling. I will miss I'm you too. I miss you so much. I'm so happy about this call.
Children, wake up. Mommy, Junior, wakey, wakey. Get up, guys. Good morning. Wake up. Let's get you guys ready for school. Okay, careful. Yeah. Start brushing your mouth. I'm coming over there to help you. Okay? Hurry up, Paul. So you don't go late to school. kids. I couldn't have done this on my own. <laughs> they are pretty well behaved, so it's so hard. <laughs> Even though. I'm sure you know what I mean. Are you enjoying the food? Ah, of course. Yes, I am. Then let's not talk about it. The oh. kids can pick the habit. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get to work. Kids, don't be late for school, okay? Alright, I'll see you guys later. Bye, Thank you. soon. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Have a beautiful day. <laughs> Careful. Mm. Bye. <laughs> Take care. Have a beautiful day. <laughs> You're still what? Come on, shut your mouth. Shut your mouth this minute. <laughs> that is all you know. Food and food and food. No, two of you. Get up immediately. Grab your bags. Grab your lunch boxes and sit there and wait for your school bus. Immediately. I said get up. <laughs> Can't you hear me? Get up, two of you, now. Get up from there. Come and push you. Hmm? <laughs> Sit down. Turn your backs. Sit there and wait for your school bus. <laughs> okay. Pull your clothes immediately. Now start pulling your clothes. Pull them. I said pull your clothes. Pull your clothes, you? Am I not talking to the two of you? Pull your clothes. Your school bus has left, and I am not about to take you pull anywhere. Do you hear me? Pull your clothes. Where are you children? Pull your clothes now! Is that what I'm talking to? Come on, pull your clothes! Call daddy. Shut up. Wait, 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 what you call daddy? So is it that I will not tell me what to do in this house? <laughs> hmm? Is, is it that I will tell me what to do in this house? Useless child. I should call daddy. You have that. I should, I should call daddy. Come on, pull your clothes! Is anything wrong? Is, is anything wrong with your ears? Pull your clothes! Pull your, pull your, pull your clothes! Pull your, pull your clothes! Move, 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 move to your wardrobe! Pull your clothes! You've been warned to stay out of jail, love, see, to stay out of strife. Yes, this is their aunt. Gina is a bit down with cold and won't be in school today, and he needs his sister by his side. So they will be back to school as soon as they can. Thank you. All right, have a good day. Bye. I brought my foot. Useless brat. Come on, move. Move. I said move. Get out from there. I have to leave my sister alone. Come, 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 come on. Come. Pick your plate! Pick your plate! Can't you hear me? Are you deaf? Don't. Pick your plate! I'm moving! Pick it! Now! Come on, pick your plate! Get up! I will hit you now if you don't get up! Get up! Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. 
I will flog you this kind of... Oh. So what? What did you need to do? What did you say? I'm not huh? going to die! Okay, you're going to fight for your brother. Is there anything wrong with you? Are you talking to me? Eh? You're going to fight for your brother. I will, I, will, I, will, I will deal with all of you in this house. I'm not going to die! I'm not going to die! I'm not going to die! Come and save him now. Go and save your brother. Let me see. I want to know how you will save him. Stupid useless children. Don't worry. I am coming for all of you. Let me see how you will save him. Nonsense. Hmm. Hmm. This is so nice. Mm -hmm. Wait, guys, why are you eating as if you've not eaten in a very long time? Junior. Junior. Your auntie Chiso. It's okay, it's okay. You know, we are just kids and I think he misses his mom. You miss your mom, right? <laughs> it's okay. Ah. It's it's fine. Um guys, there's more from where this came from, so when you finish this one and you want more, you know your darling auntie will always give you more, right? Let Auntie know. Auntie will definitely give you more, okay? <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> well, anyway, I see why they dive right in. <laughs> this is so nice. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Do you want something? Um, yeah. I actually just wanted to say thank you for <laughs> how you've taken care of the kids. It's, it's okay. Come on, these children, they need their mother and I'm the closest thing to that, so it's fine. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Honestly, I won't lie, I had my doubt at first, but seeing the way you've handled the kids, I'm sure nobody would have done it any better. <laughs> Listen, Chidi, I promise you, it's okay, just... Relax, okay? I have them covered. Okay. Uh, I'll be really proud. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me head to my room. Okay. That's all I like. Any little thing. I that this. I that that. I that I that I that I that. Every minute I die in this house. Nonsense. If you tell that this is not a good artist, I'll be maltreating us for weeks now. No, no. She will lock us in the toilet again. Evil children. What were you two planning now? What were you people talking about before I walked into this room? 
I asked you to a question. What were you planning against me? Eh? Am I not talking to you? What were you planning with your brother? <laughs> I know. You two were planning to report me to your father just now, right? You were planning to report me to your father. No problem. Just say something to your father. Say thing to your father when he comes back. <laughs> Try me and see. I will make sure I kill you two and bury you to where nobody will see you. Nonsense. Horrible children. Rubbish. Now you know what you're going to do? You will get up, get into the bathroom, clean yourselves up and wait for your father to return. When he returns, you keep smiling and looking at him and behave like the well-behaved children that you are not. Did you hear what I said? Did you hear me? Oh yeah. Get up! Get up! Move! Get down! People like you pour water and splash water all over the bathroom. When I come there, I will, I will, I will. rubbish, evil children. People are planning, planning nonsense. Say them to your father. Talk to him when he comes back. You see what I will do? Nonsense. Horrible kids. See how scattered everywhere he is. Nonsense. You, can, you, you, you people can never do anything well in this house. Don't worry. I know what to do. So they just scattered everywhere. You, 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 you're turning me to, 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 to your house help. Horrible kids. Nonsense. Rubbish. Say him to your father. Just say one thing to your father when he comes back. <laughs> Oh, my darling, you need to see the way she is with the kids. Trust me, we made the right decision, honey. She loves them and they love her as well. I'm still surprised at that. <laughs> what of the kids? I want to speak with them. Um, Chisum just went to tuck them in. I'm sure they are fast asleep, my darling. So asleep to speak to their mom? Come on, babe. Don't, don't be like this now. Uh, okay. You know what? I will go wake them up now and okay, babe. they will talk to you. I'm sure they miss you too, you know? Huh? Huh? <laughs> All right, now just give me a sec. Okay, just hold on. <sighs> Are you almost there? Oh my God, I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm still here. I'm still I miss them so much. <laughs> What's taking you so long? You've been warned to stay out of jail, love, see, to stay out of strife, stay out of what can lead to envy. Mm. Such a beautiful family. No wonder Ada always feels on top of the world. I'll make sure I take everything away from her and make money while I'm at it. When I have all of this to myself, we'll see how she treats me like a nobody. Oh, Chidi. Chidi is such a sweet man. Hmm. Negative energy eating your soul. Eat in your heart and make you stiff. You want this? You, you like this? What about you, Amy? No, I like that one. <laughs> I know you like that one. Don't worry, I'm going to get them for you too, okay? <laughs> <What's that? laughs> you know that he loves you. Am I missing out on something here? Uh, <laughs> I think that I want to get this for us. Isn't that beautiful? Let me see. Ooh. They're lovely. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's the school bus, guys. Chop, oh, chop, guys, chop, your school bus is here. Let's go. Mm. Let's go pick it up. Mm. Bye, guys. Yeah, yeah bye. Go, go, go. <laughs> bye, bye. Yeah, bye. Careful, careful. <laughs> Hurry up. Mm, yeah, oh. there you go. Okay. Bye. Take care. <sighs> Mm. 
you were kidding about getting them those shoes, right? Aren't they expensive for kids? <laughs> Look, your sister and I have always wanted to make those kids comfortable. I know you're worried about the price, but is that not the reason I work so hard? Oh. And I thought ah, that was the crazy one. <laughs> it, it, you know, it's just that all my life, no one has ever really shown me this kind of love. No one has ever put anything for me. It's just been me doing my thing all by myself. And it's... It... Chiso, I am so sorry about that. But I have to go now. I have to get to work. Yeah, of course you you, you have to go. <laughs> uh, bye. Yeah, bye. Ha have a beautiful day. You too. Take care. Yeah, bye. Such a handsome guy. <sighs> so this is what Ada has been enjoying. Hey, Chidi, how are you? Good afternoon. Hello. How are you and the kids? Oh, the kids. The kids are fine, thank you. Oh. I just fed them and, you know, we played a little and I gave them a quick bath and now they're just resting in their rooms. They are fine, very well. How are you? Yeah, I spoke with Ada and she wanted to speak with the kids, but I won't be coming home tonight. Okay, Um, is everything okay? No, no, no. It's just that I and my team have to finish up something before dawn. So I would come home, quickly take a bath and head back to the office. Um, I just wanted you to please help me take care of the kids tonight. Okay. Um, it's okay. It's okay. It won't be a problem because I'll, I'll take care of the kids. Isn't that why I'm here? <laughs> I'll take care of them. You don't have to worry. Just concentrate, okay? Everything will be fine here. Everything will be fine. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, uh, just take care of yourself and don't stress so much, okay? All right. Bye. She's not that bad after all. Oh my goodness. She's hmm. you're such a wonderful cook. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Are you to moping at me like that? Do you want to jump into my mouth? Mm -hmm. I'm the teacher, we are hungry. <laughs> so, which food do you want to eat? This one I'm eating. Is it this one that I'm eating that you two want to eat? Ha! Ah, Chiso, there is nothing you will not see in this house in the hands of this little spoiled brat. Your father wants to buy you two shoes worth over a million, right? Hmm? Why he pays me peanuts in this house? By the time I'm done with you people, I will make sure you two smell your head. Rubbish. Nonsense. Auntie, please. When he buys you those shoes, you stay at them and you'll be satisfied. No sense. Auntie, please, I spoke to the king, we just want. Come and shut up your mouth! Shut your mouth this minute! 
Which food did you keep in the kitchen? I said there is no food in this house. Why do you two keep getting me hungry for goodness sake, these children? I said there is no food. What is your problem? Get out of my face, two of you. Now. I have had enough of you. Get out, two of you. Ah, are you too deaf? I said... Devin, why are you... You've moved up. I will fuck two of you now. Come on, get out of your room. I said you should run to, run to your rooms. Silly lots. Useless children. You want to come and eat food? Nonsense. Yes, it's been hectic with the kids. I guess I overslept. Well, I see all what you're doing and I am very grateful. <laughs> I noticed you were sleeping, so I made notice for them. Oh, you did? Yeah. Okay. Relax, okay? It's been weeks now, months even, since my sister left and I knew you must be lonely and, and I knew you missed the touch of a woman. Just, you need to stop this right now. You are my wife's sister. Isn't that what makes it better? Listen, okay? I know you've been lonely and you could really use a woman's touch. That's why I'm here. No one needs to know about it. Jason, please leave. Come on. I can just. Jason. Okay. Just think about it. Negative energy eating your soul, eating your heart, and make you still. Junior. I have been teaching you this thing since. Don't get me angry. Stop wasting my time. What is 8 plus 6? Solve it now and tell me the answer. What are you doing? Stop wasting my time. Answer the question now, this boy. 14. Good. Your God has saved you. Oh God, I see that. Oh, that. Okay. Rubbish. Okay. What is 8 plus 10? Seventeen. What? Seventeen. From where? Hey! Seventeen. From where? Junior, where did seventeen come from? How is eight plus ten seventeen? Hey! Coconut head. These brains are empty. There is nothing inside your head. Hey! I thought your mother said you are smart. Where is the smartness your stupid mother keeps bragging about? Where is the smartness? And my mom is not stupid. Did I ask you? Did I invite you to this thing? Or are you solve? Six plus six. <laughs> your God will help you today. What is it? I solve it. Immediately. Give me that person. Solve six plus six. Come on, solve. No, 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 no. Always talking. Go 
coconut head. Silly girl. If your brains can work as fast as your mouth, there won't be any problem in this house. So 6 plus 6 is 13. Empty score. Useless girl. These children, they don't have anything in their brains. Your brains are empty. If you people like continue failing, the only thing your mother knows is to brag, my children are intelligent, my children are this, my children are that. And your father will be busy buying expensive shoes, expensive clothes, expensive items to buy for you people every day. You don't know anything. He's just wasting money paying your school fees. For nothing. Useless children. See, it's not you people stress in this house. You people will not kill me. I will not have Bible prayer because of you people. I'm going to my room to rest. If you like, you fail your homework. If you like, you solve it. If you like, you fail. It's your business. Go and fail in your school. Get that let me pass. Rubbish. So I should use washing machine and wash your clothes. Eh? What happened to your hands? What happened to your hands? You useless. Is this how to wash? Silly girl. Don't worry. I will show you how to wash. Take this clothes. Put it inside there and start squeezing immediately. Do it now. Look at the girl I'm talking to. Wash clothes. I said you should wash, wash, wash like this. Wash it like this. That's how to good. Harder, 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 harder. Wash this clothes, my friend. Nonsense. You are here singing. Wash! You are not washing. Wash! Come on, will you wash those clothes? I... Come on, wash! Wash like this! Like this! This less girl. You want washing machine? Wonder what are you forgotten about me? Uh, Daddy, how can you say that? No. No, no, no. How can I forget about you? Yeah, because um, uh, you know how much of a tool it is with the kids, right? So yeah. it really hasn't been easy. Mm, but um you, you kinda look different, you know. Occasionally zoning off and smiling. Have you, have you met somebody finally? Are you seeing uh, someone? What? The See? <laughs> what? No! Then it, then I'm, I'm not seeing anyone. Right. Come on. All right. I barely even have time for myself, oh, you know, with the kids. Right. So, All right. no, no, I'm All not right. seeing anyone. Well, but, uh, but do you get to speak with your sister, at least? Daddy, why do I need to speak with Ada? She's your sister. It's been over two months now since I've been at house doing the job we agreed I should do. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, what does speaking we had have to do with anything? All right. Does it make my job complete? No, it's okay. Um, nothing. Okay. Daddy, please. It's all right. Anyway, <laughs> enough of all of this. Mm. So, tell me, how have you been? How oh, you could be better. What's going on here? <laughs> oh, wow. Some nice things for my lovely babies. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Ami! Junior! Yes, come, 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 come. Auntie got you guys. Lovely, lovely things. <clears throat> so, darlings. On my way back home, I stopped by the store to get you two lovely, lovely, lovely things. So how about you go upstairs and try them on. Let's see how they fit. This is yours, my darling. Uh, 
Come on, Amy, take it. Uh -huh. And as for you, Junior, I got this for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. So, go upstairs, try them on, let's see how they fit. I'll be waiting. <laughs> <laughs> careful, careful. <laughs> Lovely kids, I love them. I love them so much. <laughs> thank you once again. Well, you know you don't have to thank me, right? Ah, but I want to because, <laughs> you know, it's not easy taking care of other people's kids. And, just so, you have a good heart. <laughs> Maybe you should show it all the time. Let's just say I show my good heart to the people I want to show it to. Chisum. Chidi, you see. Chisum. Relax, okay? How long has it been now? I know you miss your wife. And I know you want the touch of a woman. Come on. Chisum, stop. Listen, Chidi. Stop fighting it, okay? I know you want this. Don't you? Chisum. Chisum. So this is what Ada has been enjoying. Hmm. Madam High and Mighty. No wonder she feels she's on top of everyone else. Hey. How are you? Good morning. Chiso. I hope you slept well. Because I sure did. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Who wouldn't, right? After a beautiful night of fashion. Chiso, stop. This wasn't the impression you were giving me yesterday. Come on. Yesterday you were screaming. Oh, Chisom, oh, you're so sweet down there. Have you forgotten? Come on. Chisom, please stop it. Listen. We can get another of the kids out of the school. You know, it shouldn't be a bad thing to do. Just. We put in the mood and you know we want this, right? After all, we will feel... We are nothing, Chisum. This is exactly what I came to talk to you about. What did you come to talk to me about? What? Did you come here to tell me that what happened yesterday was a mistake? Chisum, I came here to tell you that this or whatever happened was a mistake. It was not a mistake. You can't tell me it was a mistake. What do you mean it was a mistake? What part of it was a mistake? The part where you were kissing me? Where you were licking me all over? The part where you were ripping my clothes apart? So please stop. The part where you carried me upstairs so the kids will see you here? Or the part where you refused to take your wife's call when she was calling you? Tell me! Tell me, tell me! What part of yesterday was a mistake? Chisum! Please! Stop it! We will not stop anything. There is nothing to stop, okay? We both wanted this. Yes, you wanted me as much as I wanted you. And our fair is never a mistake. So don't you ever tell me again that yesterday was a mistake. Because we both know it wasn't. You and I were in the mood yesterday, so it happened. You can't deny it. You will not deny it. I will let you deny it. Nonsense. Daddy, you are ready. I'm coming. I 
terrible. Am I such a bad person that nobody wants me? Nobody ever wants to keep anything with me. Is there anything wrong with me? What do you mean it was a mistake? How was it a mistake? You were all over me yesterday. <sighs> had unprotected sex. What happens after unprotected sex? Pregnancy. Duh. Jisoo, do you realize that I'm married to your sister? Oh, please, Chidi, cut me some slack, okay? We had an affair. And yes, I realize. What's wrong with you, Jisoo? So what do you want me to tell your sister? What do you want me to tell Ada? Look, Chiso, this was a mistake. Don't I don't you ever say that to me again. I don't know what you intend to do about this, and I don't care, okay? Because I'm three weeks gone already. And I'm not keeping this baby, nor you the father, as a secret. Are you out of your mind, Chiso? This is the first time something important is happening in my life and I will not let you ruin my chances. Get your acts together and prepare to tell Ada. Because I will raise this baby with you, the father in the picture. Chiso, I will say this once and once only. So I need you to open those ears of yours and listen to every word I say. I will not be part of this. I will not partake of this rubbish. So now, you will pick yourself. Go to that room. Pack your things. And get the hell out of my house. <laughs> I will go over there. Hi, baby. Oh my god, look at you guys! But I missed you guys so much! Babe? I missed you, mommy! I know! Hi, baby! What are you doing here? Why, why didn't you call? Are you not supposed to be in UK? Am I not allowed to come back to my house again? I mean, I wanted to surprise you. You didn't even give me a whole great kiss. Uh, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, no, babe, come on. <laughs> this is your home. <laughs> And I missed you. I missed you too. <laughs> Hi, my baby. Hi, 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 Hi Chiso. I'm, I'm back. Oh, um. <laughs> I missed you, baby. You did? Come here, my babies. Come here, my little babies. Oh, I missed you guys. But that shouldn't be a problem. You can go back when you want to, yeah? I mean, you fought so hard for this. This can be the end, right? No, it's not, babe. They said I could come back after three months. That's what they said. Ah, okay. Oh. oh, babe, I've missed you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you see the way the kids barely left your side? They all <laughs> missed you, my darling. Mm. 
Babe? Yeah? Chisom didn't even welcome me. Like, she literally left without saying anything to me. She just packed her bag and left. Without even saying a word to me. Like, I get that this was the agreement. That's fine. But, I mean, that's not a, that's not a right way to behave now. Look, babe. I think you should forget her. I mean, we don't owe her anything. We've paid her everything. If she won't value you, then just let her be. She did. Look, I am serious. You just go back and I don't want anything to stress you, my darling. I just want to hold you. <laughs> feel you close to me, my darling. Mm, mm. That sounds interesting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi, babies. <coughs> <laughs> My sweet babies, how are you? Daddy, please, this is not a good time, okay? What? I thought you just came back and you're already back here. Like something is pursuing you, Chisholm. Why do you hate your sister so much? Why? Could you, couldn't you just have stayed back and interact like a normal human being? Daddy, please, can you just let me be? What is the problem now? She's back and my job there is done. To my father's house again. What is this fuss about? Just leave me alone, Daddy. I, I, I need my peace. Leave me alone. Chisel. Why, why do you look like this? You... Daddy, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I have gone. All I should as a, as, a, as a father. But you are just not it. <laughs> Jesus, I came here to tell you that this or whatever happened was a mistake. Maybe you're right. Maybe I'm not just it. That's why I ruined my chance at everything. <laughs> that was why I willingly dropped out of school. I couldn't even snatch a man. I, I guess I'm not just it. What is this? Oh my god. Who did this to you, Amy? And the Chisholm did this to you. Jesus Christ. Chidi! Chidi! Oh my god. Why didn't you tell your dad? She loved in your arms. 
She said if you tell anyone, we so will kill us. What? How did this happen and you didn't notice? How did you not even notice that they were emaciating? So she was hitting and stabbing my children are you in this house and you did not notice anything? I was always at work. There was no way I could possibly have known. She, she, she was nice Enough to of this nonsense! Enough! You know what? I think I am done actually keeping quiet. I'm actually done. Babe. Stand up. Babe. Babe, where are you going? I will not allow anybody to lay hands on my children and not hands out to me. So you know exactly where I'm going to. Babe, just, just calm down. I will handle this. I promise I will. What will you handle? What will you handle? Tell me, Chidi. I left these children in your care. And all of this is happening without your notice. Look at my daughter's back. Look at my daughter's back. No, I, I, Excuse I, me, I'll handle it myself. Go, babe. go, 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 go. Right? That was fast. What? Shut up. Listen, he came after me, okay? It was him who came after me. I made no wedding vows to you, so I owe you no loyalty. <laughs> you should be the one you should be fighting. Hey, what is she talking about? Quiet. Rubbish. What is she talking about? Jesus. Jesus, keep quiet! Isn't it why you're here? Hasn't he told you all that happened between us that night? You haven't told her? What are you waiting for? I thought that's why we're here. He is the father of my child. Jesus, I said you should keep quiet. Leave me alone. Come on, 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 come Jesus Christ! Babe, it was just once. Jesus Christ! Babe, babe, babe! Oh, please! Babe! Chisong. Heaven knows I tried all my best with you. But you, you have no heart. Now I want you to get up. Go up there and pack your things and leave my house right now. You are evil and from this moment on, I 
disown you as mine. You are evil. What did I do? Now I said, get out of my house. I said, get out of my house. What did I do? Don't let me repeat. I said, you came after me. Let me get out. Why do you want me to go? I said, get out of my sight. Get out. You can't just get out of my house. So where do I go? You came after me. You should have thought about that. I mean, I was with so him and he came after their children. I mean, I didn't do anything. Maybe he came after me. Again. I am sorry, babe. It's just once, babe. babe. It was just once. Once, please. I am sorry, please. Did you say once? Once, twice, ten times. It's all the same, Chini. You slept with my sister. You were busy sleeping with my sister that you didn't even notice that she was maltreating my kids. Our children! Chidi! Please, 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 let's just talk about it. I'll try and figure everything out there, please. Please don't do this, babe. Look, Chidi, there's no time for this, honestly. I'm sorry. Because she's pregnant for you. And I have to deal with the consequence of your own actions. And God forbid, Chidi, God forbid that I forget or forgive this insult! Babe, 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 so disgusting. Oh, babe, please, it's me, oh. babe, babe, it's, it's, it's me. It's me, Chidi, babe, please, please. Babe, 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 Hey, don't, don't do this, babe! So, babe, 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 babe! Ah! What are you still doing in this house? I have a few things to say to you. Are you hot? <laughs> That's the first. She's home. I pay the rent in this house. Every single thing you see here was furnished by me. So I want you to get out and never, Chisom, do you hear me? Never return to this place again because I do not want to lay my eyes on you. Do you understand me? The prettier one. The better one. The one with the better grades. The one loved by everyone. The one with all the finest things of life. The one with the class and poise. That is best girl. The one that has the solutions to every of daddy's problems. The one that daddy always runs to the one with the perfect life with the perfect family the one whose everything is perfect 
is that frustration I see? Do you feel betrayed right now? Oh, this is exactly how you've always made me feel all my life. Well, I'm sorry, Jason. I'm sorry that you refuse to walk. How can the good things of life come to you when you've never gone after it? You stand here and talk about how I am dad's favorite. The one with the best grades. The one everyone loves. I did all of that just so that I can cover up for you! But has that ever been enough for you? Has it? Oh, my sacrifice. I had to be the one to walk day in and day out. Just so that we can make ends meet. All the sacrifices I made. Still, it was not enough for you, Chisum. You went after my husband. Oh, please. You hit my kids. They were supposed to be your niece and nephew. I left them in your care. You were supposed to be my sister. You were supposed to have my back. Jesus, when you stand here and you talk about betrayal, you want what's mine? You can have him. Is it Chidi? Is that the problem? Is that what you want? Oh, here. Here. Just on here. You can have him. You can have him. If you think for a slight minute or even a slight second that Chidi is going to take you in, then Chisom, you are even a bigger fool than I thought you were. No, you will watch what you say to me, okay? Watch your mouth. Oh, my darling Chisom. You have just subscribed to premium suffering. <laughs> we'll see about that. But guess what? Daddy is not going to be here anymore to cover up for you. And neither will I. Now you are left all alone. Just get out, please. And, and, and we'll see about lying. that. She's, she's not lying. You had your chance. She's a man, you messed everything up. You had the opportunity, but you dropped out of school to, to leech off of me. Everybody knows how mean, wicked, and, and, and terrible person you are. You drove everybody away from you. So you are the architect of your own misfortune. Now walk. Of course I'll walk. Yes, I walk. Get out. And I am walking straight into the arms of the father of my child. He will take absolute care of me. Yes. And as for this ring, have your ring back. My baby daddy will give me a better one than that. Rubbish. We'll see about that. No, I won't blame it on the serpent. I fell and I knew it. I did wrong, I can hide it. Oh, I'm feeling the guilt. What's wrong with me? Am I crazy? What's going on in that head? And I feel ashamed of what I've turned into. Every thoughtless thing I've done keeps haunting me down. Oh, I'm sorry. We need to talk. I regret I'm sorry. If I could Jenny! The Jenny, you can't keep avoiding me. We need to discuss about this pregnancy. Oh, I'm sorry. Jenny, open the door so that we can talk. I regret <laughs> I'm sorry. Open the door, Chidi. 
You know there is no way you will keep up with me, right? You have avoided me today. I will come back tomorrow and the day after. And then I will keep coming until you allow me to discuss this thing with you. My selfish thoughts just cursed me, babe Who's gonna help me, Lord, I'm broken I'm sorry, I'm sorry Oh, I'm sorry Oh, I'm sorry Oh, I'm sorry I regret everything I've done Oh, I'm sorry Oh, oh I'm sorry I know you probably want to be on your own now. I've talked the kids in and I'll be going over to your house to pick up their clothes for school tomorrow. But you don't have to keep blaming yourself. None of this is your fault. How much longer are you going to keep beating yourself over this? No, I won't blame it on the serpent. I fell and I knew it. Ada. Ada, please, I'm sorry. Ada, I miss you, Ada. Please. Open up, let's talk, Ada. Ah, for us. For the kids, Ada, please. Please, open up. I miss my family. Ada. Ada. Babe. If I could right the wrongs of I've been selfish or I'm wrong. Oh, I'm sorry. I regret I'm sorry. All the pains of God. Wish I could change the way things are. Wish I could write the song again. Wish I could take a Chidi. Sir, we made it clear. We don't want to see either you or Chisholm anywhere around here. So why are you here? Yes, sir. Sir, please. Sir, please. Miss Ada. I don't have anything to do with Chisholm. I already told her that. Sir, please. Aren't you even ashamed to appear before me or her? Sir, I'm ashamed. I am very much ashamed, but I miss her. I miss my family, sir. Please help me talk to her, sir. sir she did. She did. Sir, go home. Huh? You've been coming here for the last three weeks and nothing has changed. Don't you get it? Go home. Sir, please. 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 You guys think you can just mess up your families at will? Like, like wives don't have any feelings. No, sir. And you expect that they were willing to, to, to accept you back after you apologize. You, you're pathetic. Get out of my sight. Please, sir, sir. Sir, please. Please, sir. Please help, help me talk to us, sir. Oh, please. Please help me talk to us, sir. Ada! Ada! Look, look Trudy. <laughs> sir, I, I, I will call the I, I will call the cops for you. Get out, get out, leave this place. I said leave this place. Sir, please, sir. Get out of here. Sir, Ada. Sir, please. Please, sir. Ninkompu. Hello? Oh, hi. Um... Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Yes, like I said, I'll be needing it for two kids. Oh, no, the both of them. Okay. Um, 
once I get the email and the dates out, you know, commence preparations. All right, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you. You okay? Here I come. Okay, night. <laughs> Thanks for coming. <sighs> You look better. Yes, Dad. I will not allow those horrible people make me look miserable. But you do know he's outside, waiting. I don't care, Dad. He can be waiting there for 70 years for all I care. <sighs> it's not going to change anything. You know, Amy and Junior said he comes to see them at school and he comes with snacks and goodies they're asking questions then why aren't they living together as a family what am i going to tell them well um that's all he's going to be getting for now dad as for the children when the kids are old enough to understand what's going on i would definitely tell them the truth but wait, are you really going to divorce him You know what, Dad? I think I want to see him. I think I want to see the both of them together. The both of them? Yes. Can you make that happen? No, wait, wait, wait a minute. What are you thinking? What do you have in mind? What I, I should have done a long time ago. Instead of bottling all this feeling and crying here. Okay. I can make that happen. Okay. I'll call them. Okay, but, Dad. But, but you, you'll be calm. Stay calm. Of course. Take it easy. It's going to be all right. <laughs> of course, Dad. <laughs> all right, Dad. <laughs> but you do look good. Thank <laughs> look you, Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> Listen, Ada. I don't know why you invited us here. But whatever it is, can you make it fast? My baby daddy and I have somewhere we need to go. Babe, I am so sorry. Please, just talk. I, I am listening. I, I am willing to do anything you want me to do to make this work, please. Um, so I'm in the process of filing for a divorce. So you should get served soon. What? <laughs> babe, babe, babe. We can make things right? Yes, babe. No. Yes. I'm sorry, it's too late for that. You already ruined our marriage. Chidi, we had a good thing going for us, but you decided to ruin it. You and this daughter of Jezebel. Ada, do not call me that, okay? I am nothing like what you're calling. You are nothing, exactly. You're nothing. That is why when you see people happy, it aches you. Because you don't have anything good going on for you. You always want to ruin other people's happiness because you are nothing but the devil. Babe, babe. I am so sorry. It was just once, babe. I, I, I was ready to put it all in the past and just move on, babe. I, I am sorry. It will never, it will never happen again. And you couldn't be faithful? If I could be faithful for months, so could you. Yeah, I know that men are polygamous in nature, but so are women. Yes. But when you have self-dignity and self-respect, you will not swim in the mud, unlike some people. Madam. Please. You disrespected your marriage vows, so now you're going to face the consequence of your actions. Okay. This marriage is over and I just thought I'd let you know. And as for you, you've never for once attracted anything good in life. And that is why men will always smash and run because you're good for nothing. Daddy, I don't know 
if Ada invited me here to be insulted. But I will not have any more of her insults. Well, now the two of you are free to be with each other. <laughs> yes. At least for the child that you're carrying. Okay. As for my children, my children are going to go far, far away from this toxic environment. Okay. What do you mean? What do I mean? You're going to find out soon. You're going to find out from the court. Because with those bruises on my children's body, those are evidence. I'm gonna get full custody, my darling. Please, 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 babe, babe. That'll be all. Look at this, babe, babe. to talk. We need to discuss this. Is that why you told them? Because you think I'm going to have anything to do with you and that thing you have in you. Look, I'm going to say this once and once only. Chidi, listen, I have nowhere to go. I, I, aside from the money from the house, I, 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 I don't have any other I don't have any way to go to now. You listen, don't, don't, don't do this to me, please. I'm happy. You are nothing to me. And I don't want anything to do with you. And you see that thing you have in you is going to grow up without a dad. You know why? Because people like you end up old, miserable, and lonely. Chili, Chili, please, I'm, 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 I'm begging you in the name of God, Chili. You, you can't, you can't abandon us now. It's your child I'm carrying on. Listen, I'm, I'm, I was fighting for you. I was fighting for us. Chili, so you are crazy. I'm selfish. And I swear if to God that even with a gun to my head, Chiso, I won't have anything to do with you. Do you understand me? Chili, please. please. Chiso, I am going to please. say this one last please. time. Please think about this. I'm begging you. Please, I, I, I don't know what to do. Please, just we need to talk about this. Please, please let me to. I'm carrying your child. The next time I set my eyes on you, you will be in the hospital, and me, I will be in prison. Please, please. Now, get the hell out of my way. Chidi, you're being irrational now. This is not the way you should be talking now, Chidi. See now, this is your baby. How can you... Please now, just, just think about this. You're, you're not thinking straight. Please now. I'm, I'm not begging you. See, just... Chidi, please now. Chidi, hey, Chidi, I'm carrying your child though. Chidi, this is not fair now. Just, just listen to me now, please. Chidi, wait now. Come in. Are you sure about this, Ada? About taking my children and starting afresh? Instead of forgiving my husband that slept with my sister? Oh, come on, Ada. Oh, yes, Daddy, I am sure. I need a new environment to, to, to start afresh, Dad. To properly heal and maybe, you know, even remarry, who knows? You know, I'm glad of what you've done and how you've handled things and I will support every single action you take. Really? Really, yes. Because Chisholm went too far on your children. And, and that, that sadly affair with Chidi, you have no business for giving such. And, and thankfully you have so much going on for yourself right now. Just pick up the pieces and continue. You'll be fine. 
Thank you so much, Dad. <laughs> Look, I am glad and, and I am thankful that not for once have I regretted being your father. Ada, you will be greater. You will triumph. And in all of this, you have been the winner. Oh, <laughs> and I'm super proud of how you, you handle this whole thing. <laughs> Thank you so much. You are uh, your father's daughter. <laughs> <laughs> and and, and I'll, I'll be with you every step of the way. But I am going to miss you. I am going to sure miss you. you. I love you. I love you. Thank oh. you so much, Dad. Oh, I don't blame it on the serpent. I fell and I knew it I did wrong, I can hide it Oh, I'm feeling the guilt What's wrong with me? Am I crazy? What's going on in that head? And I feel ashamed of what I've turned into Every thoughtless things I've done Keeps hunting me down Oh, I'm sorry, I regret I'm sorry If I could right the wrongs I've done I've been selfish, oh, I'm wrong Oh, I'm sorry, I regret I'm sorry All the pains have cost another Wish I could change the way things are Wish I could write the song again Wish I could take away the pain Look what I've done to me again My selfish thoughts has caused me pain Who's gonna help me, Lord, I'm broken